Hello, it's Jennifer from Sea Lemon. Welcome back to HGTV Handmade. I recently did a craft supply swap with Karen Cavett and you can check that video out right here. She sent me so many fun little holiday craft supplies and I wanted to incorporate those into my next DIY project. I gave it some thought as to what that would be and I decided to make a couple of cute and simple Christmas ornaments. A ribbon tree and a 3D OG shaped ornament which could also be considered a mid-century modern type ornament. These are pretty easy to make and can be customized if you want to change the sizes and colors to fit your holiday decor. Okay, let's get to it! For this simple tree ornament, I'm starting with a single threaded needle of craft thread, these wooden beads, and this ribbon from our supply swap. String on one bead to the very end, and tie a knot around the bead so that it's secure on the thread. You can thread the needle back into the bead so that you can hide the knot, and then trim off the excess thread. Now with this single bead sewn on, start sewing into the ribbon. This first line will be the base of the tree, and sew on another bead after that and sew into the ribbon once again. String on another bead and you'll start to form the tree by looping the ribbon back and forth, making smaller loops as you go up so that it makes a tree shape and putting a bead between each loop. When you get to the top of the tree, string on the last bead, tie it in a knot just like you did with the first bead, but leave enough thread to loop around to form a hanger. Trim off any excess thread and ribbon, and I thought Karen's mini bow would make a good tree topper for this mini tree ornament. Next, I'm going to make a simple OG shaped ornament using paper. I cut a strip of this sparkly paper, traced it onto the back of another piece so that I got it to be the same size, and then traced it again onto this red paper so that I have a strip of red. Cut those out and all together you want to have three strips of paper all the same size. Fold one strip in half and glue it together. This will be the middle portion of the ornament and I wanted it to be sparkly on both sides. Fold the other two strips in half, place a line of glue on the inside fold of one strip and then glue that center strip to it. Now we're going to form a curve by putting a line of glue on the end of the middle strip, slightly push that strip up to form a curve and glue it in place. Repeat that same step on the other side forming that curve shape and gluing it in place. Now repeat those steps with the last strip, putting the glue on the folded edge and putting the entire ornament you have on that glue and gluing down a curved edge on both sides. When the glue has dried, you can trim off the excess paper on the end. And now you just need a hanger for this ornament. I used a piece of Karen's metallic silver ribbon, gluing the ends on each side. Now this 3D OG shaped ornament is ready to display on a tree. I really like how these ornaments turned out. Hit that like button if you do too and let me know what you think in the comments below. I will definitely be working the rest of the supplies Karen sent me in future projects. If you want to complete your Christmas tree with a topper to go along with these ornaments, check out this DIY star over on my channel Sea Lemon and I will see you soon with another fun holiday project. Bye!